Good morning, everyone. Good Monday morning. Welcome to a brand new week. Uh, I was talking to the Lord this morning. Uh, he's been teaching me lately about the gifts that he has available for us and all that he wants to give us each day. I've been listening to a lot of Graham Cook videos. And honestly, if you don't have a subscription to his Brilliant TV package, I recommend you get one if you can. Um, or watch his free stuff on YouTube. And uh, it's just this concept that the Lord's been reminding me of this week is that he has gifts available for us in everything that we go through each each day so today when we look at today especially on Monday morning I, I heard a statistic and don't quote me on it because I think it's generally true but um, that most heart attacks happen first thing on a Monday morning as people anticipate the week that they're going into as they look at the problems that they're facing the things from last week that they have to deal with this week the obstacles that they have to come overcome um, the the things that look insurmountable in the coming week and it just it produces so much stress of going back to work of handling with these things that people feel you know we don't go into the week with hope but that's where we as children of God get to go into the week with a totally different perspective this perspective of the expectation of the goodness of God in the land of the living as David says in the Psalms and so this week um I'm encouraging you to go into today. That's what I did this morning. It's just thinking about all the gifts that God has to give me today. So it doesn't mean that there aren't obstacles. It doesn't mean that there aren't challenges. It doesn't mean that there aren't things that are going to be difficult to do. But it does mean that the one who knows how to do them with us, how to overcome them, how to help us through them is with us. And that is what gives us hope. Not the fact that there's no difficult things to overcome, but the fact that God is with us, that the Holy Spirit delights to be with us. And so God has got these, the, the picture he gave me was, instead of looking at the three obstacles that have to be overcome today, to actually look at it as the three gifts that he has within him being with us in overcoming those obstacles, in, in walking through them, in learning what we need to learn, in seeing the goodness of God, in, in seeing his character in those circumstances, those are the gifts that we get to unpack today. And the coolest thing, of course, is that that completely aligns with his heart, which is to be in relationship with us. He doesn't just give us a a solution and go there you go and implement it he actually says I want to be with you in the middle of that in this one there's an opportunity to see from heaven's perspective so Lisa if you're looking at it this way what would heaven have to say about that what's the truth in this one there's the truth that I can give you to replace a lie that you believe so Lisa will you accept this opportunity to believe the truth instead of a lie uh, in this uh, situation that you're facing today, there's the opportunity to forgive someone and to learn from me how to actually do that from Kingdom's perspective. So there's just so many gifts available today and I want to encourage you today to say yes to them, to look at today and go, wow, Lord, thank you that no matter what comes up today, greater is he who is in me than he that's in the world. You are faithful to complete what you finished. There's so many scriptures that support this. Um, that you are with me today and I am more than a conqueror through Christ who loves me <laughs> because the Holy Spirit is with us. So unpack the gifts of God today. Know that the first gift is that his heart is to be with us in the middle of everything that we get to go through today with him. And then look at the gifts that he has and unpack them with him today. Get to see things the way he does from his perspective um, and walk out those brilliant promises that he has for us. So I bless you guys to have, to go on this adventure with Jesus today, to go, Lord, what do we get to unpack today? What do we get to know today? What do we get to be able to walk in that'll equip us today? Because we come from fullness, right? God has given us everything already. So we get to unpack the gifts of inheritance. Bless you guys. Have an amazing day on this adventure with your Jesus. And I will see you again. Bless you guys.